Hi guys, we're going to have a look today at uh, updating your profile information uh, on your Moodle 2.3 course. Um, your profile is a great way to uh, link up with other people on your course, uh, share interests and uh, also allow people to um, contact you via other, other social media. Uh, two different ways that you can get to your profile. You can either, uh, on your profile settings, the left hand side here you can click edit profile uh, or on the right hand side at the top there you can click your name that takes you through to your profile as you can see here I don't have a photo so that's one of the things that I'm going to show you how to do is to upload your photo so everybody else on your course can see what you look like so click on edit profile now depending on what kind of authentication is set up on your site, you may or may not be able to change some of these settings. Um, just scrolling down, everything is uh, very self-explanatory. Uh, a few to point out to you. Um, email display, you can completely hide your email from everybody if you want to. Um, or you can allow anybody uh, to see your email address. Um, HTML settings there for email, you can have it in either plain text or HTML, um, so with nice formatting and things like that. When, that's for instance when messages are sent to you or forum posts. Um, another thing about forum posts, so uh, part of Moodle, uh, the forums will um, can be set to send you either uh, a daily email with the full posts or every time somebody posts to a forum you can see the, the whole of that post. Um, it depends how active your site is. If there's only a few posts going out every now and again um, then just keep it on no digest. Um, if it's a very active site where you're getting lots of posts you may want to um, condense them down so you're getting less emails. Uh, you can track when or uh, when you've seen forum posts um, and editing text you can have uh, either the standard or HTML editor and that's um, where you see any of the editing boxes like this. Um, okay, so uh, a couple of the other bits to point out. Uh, you can add a description of yourself, there's my description. Uh, I don't have a photo yet of myself, so I'm just going to drag something across from my desktop. I'd really encourage you to get um, all of your users to uh, edit their user profiles as one of the first things. Uh, interests, people can add their own interests. And then you can, uh, again, this is how it depends on how your administrator's got it set up for you. Um, but you can uh, you can have links to all sorts of other social media um, and other information about yourself there. So once you're happy, click on update profile. And there we go. There's my updated. Um, profile on this site. As I said, it's really worth doing. One of the first things that everybody should do when they're new to a site and something people should regularly do, um, go back to it and update it. Um, just to point out a little thing here on the interest at the bottom where I put those tags, you can actually click those and see uh, who else on your site has that same interest. Um, <laughs> I'm the only person on this site at the moment, so uh, just me, but a really nice way to create some links between your users. Thanks for listening.